Thanks for joining. Let's take a look at this week's Onshape Tech Tip. Converting legacy sheet metal into sheet metal parts that users can unfold in Onshape is a straightforward process. Import the legacy part, then open the sheet metal model feature. Select Thicken, check Tangent Propagation, and select one face of the part. Tangent propagation automatically selects the tangent faces, so manually selecting each face is not required. Once selected, a flat pattern preview appears inside the sheet metal table in flat view flyout. Tangent edges appear in each bend location within the flat pattern, but no bend center lines are present. Click inside edges or cylinders to bend and select each bend on the imported part. Enter sheet metal parameters such as material thickness, bend radius, k-factor, and reliefs. Flip material thickness direction if required. If the thickness or inner bend radius is unknown, use the measure feature. After accepting the feature, two parts are present, the legacy part and a sheet metal part. If the imported part is no longer required, right-click on the part and select Delete. When converting imported parts to sheet metal, avoid importing parts with formed features or use direct editing tools and remove them before converting. There should be rounded corners where every bend is before converting. Make sure to remove any interference or coincident edges and diagnose any errors based on the flat pattern displayed. Using the Thicken workflow, legacy sheet metal parts can be imported and converted to workable sheet metal models in Onshape. Once imported and converted, the part acts like a sheet metal part created from scratch in Onshape. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more video tech tips.